So here is something that is always fun. Using painter's tape and making a design on the paper. Just take a piece, rip it easily. Make at least two go all the way from end to end. But the more you do make from end to end, the more shapes you will be able to fill in. Okay, so I have, see, I made triangles and other shapes. And now I'm making another shape because I went from end to end and there are more shapes. But if you just wanted to do the letter of your name, go right ahead. Oh, I might as well do my last name the letter of my last name, but one, two, and three. Okay, so once you have that done, maybe remember to write your name on the back. Then we're going to take some paint and just fun and easy, paint it any way you want to, but let's remember how to mix colors at the same time. So you dip, rub it gently, and we have yellow, just plain yellow. I'm going to let the yellow go into the next box because I will mix it with another color. So now I have to wash my brush every time you change. Dip, 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 wipe, wipe, wipe. Yellow and blue, what does that make? Wow, that's a beautiful greenish blue. I'm gonna bring it down into the next box because I just like it. And then you can decide, maybe you wanna just put some dashes because blue and yellow makes green. You can put blue on top of yellow anytime or yellow on top of blue anytime. Now for a new color, dip, 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 wipe, wipe. So it's clean. I'm gonna take red. And red is a primary color, just like yellow and just like blue. So I can choose to make, um, to mix it to make a new color. So I'm gonna do the same thing I did before, just plain red on top and then bring it down to the bottom. But I need to wash my brush, one, two, wipe, wipe. And I'm gonna take a little blue and see if it makes Purple, it does. I think I need a little more red, but you can see it makes a dark purple, like a plum color. So I'm gonna put a little more red. And remember, let's remember that next time. Put more red and just a little bit of blue to make purple. And what else? We have green. What about orange? How do you make orange? Well, you need a lot of yellow, okay? Because yellow is so light. Remember what happened? Um, because red was lighter than blue. So now I'm doing yellow and I'm gonna mix it with wash, wipe, wipe with red. Because yellow and red make orange that's right so i'm going to take more yellow because i want it to be a more yellowish orange but it can be a really dark orange too and then if you want the paint has a green i'm just going to put some plain green and make some stripes now you should let it dry for a few minutes before you do the next step but let's see if it works. The next step is the fun part. You peel off the tape and voila, you have a print because the tape stopped the paint from getting through to the paper. If you push down your tape a little hard, like maybe a little too hard, it rips. So, Maybe I pushed that tape down a little too hard, but if that happens, you can touch it up. Or actually, I don't think it looks that bad, right? I don't think so. Okay, so I'm almost done. I hope you like it, and I hope 
you're happy with whatever you make. It doesn't have to be like mine. I did another one differently. I did not make the letters of my name. I went like that. Well, I'm going to go peel these off and see how this one comes out. Have a good time.